all things come from you, and of your own have we given you. Each time the offering is brought to the altar, the priest repeats these words. But where do they come from? First Chronicles, 29th chapter. King David had just received tons of gold and silver from the people of Israel to build God's temple. Not ounces, not pounds, but tons. Everyone had given something, and David was recognizing who it belonged to, God. So where did all that God gave you to give at St. Mary's go? I mean, at a time when everything seems like it's closed down, St. Mary's has been busy uh, doing a lot, including uh, the, the calling of a third priest. Uh, Patsy McGregor is coming in order to be able to continue to, to expand our skill in being able to share that good news with family, with kids, with our community that's around us. Uh, but that just fits in with all of the rest of the, the investments that, uh, that we've made here at St. Mary's. Through Backpack Buddies, uh, we've supported 75 kids uh, in order to be able to provide for them meals through House of Hope, in order to be able to get them the, the basic essentials that, that they need. We, we continue to support Project Lift. We, Mary's Kitchen sends meals over to Project Lift in order to support those teens in their work. There are numbers of projects that we're involved in that help support kids and families, including Family Promise. So if we want to have an effect in the lives of our kids and of our families who are living very fast-paced lives, we've got to be able to continue to update our technology. And so we want to make that the focal point of our, of our stewardship campaign for this coming year, to, to continue to invest in ways that we can be effective in capturing the minds and the imaginations of, of our kids kids, of our families, of the people who are in need out there, and to continue to connect us with some of the best resources that are available in the country. And I'm so glad we can be a part of it together. King David was so impressed by God's unstoppable generosity, he prayed to God these words, God, keep this generous spirit alive forever in these people always, and keep their hearts firmly in you. As we continue growing into Jesus, and reaching out with love at St. Mary's, we pray those words of David again as God leads you to fill out your 2021 pledge card. Mm -hmm.